Alright, here we are, once again. Welcome to the greatest show on earth. I say that with as much enthusiasm as I can muster. Hi, it's Devlin. It's been a hot minute. But it's only been... Uh, I don't even have... I don't even have a reason to, for why. You know, it's just... It's, it's not been a very good week. But we're back. We got Kirby. First game of the week. First game of the, the stream week, too. It's been, a, it's been a hot minute, like I said. So, let's just... I know last time we had, um... Done some... We, we finished... Yeah, Winter Horns. How do I go to the new one? Oh, yeah, that's right. Ooh. Yeah, I need to get the final blueprint, but I have no idea where. You know? Oh, does this mean I... No? What? So why does that have a different star from... Oh, wait, no, that's the problem. Yeah, okay, okay. Now we're going. Hello there. Oh my goodness. I'm so, like... I'm so lost. I don't know what the heck I'm doing. I'm tired. It's, been, it's not been a very good week. Alright. So we're just, we're just, we're just, we'll play some Kirby, you know? That's what matters. Yeah, so happy, happy Easter to everyone that celebrates it. I, I don't really, oh my goodness. Maybe I should jump. Maybe I should jump. Oh my goodness. Uh, there we go. Yeah, that didn't work. I feel like I'll still be able to, to, to match the target time. If not, just a little, you know, slower. Oh yeah, we got this. Never mind. Oh my goodness, they make you go all the way back to the beginning. This is, this is basically... This has been what my entire day has been. Cause all of my all of my eggs gone. That's, that's what I that's what I will say. I hope everyone enjoys their eggs. Yeah, hopefully volume is good. I, I haven't I haven't been on this in like a week essentially, so. It could be good, it could be bad. What? Okay, that's a... That's upsetting. Alright, we're good. Whoop. Now, why can I not jump? I don't get it. There we go. Hey, I think it was 45 seconds. Okay, it was 40 seconds. I was off by a little bit. I don't have a whole lot to talk about today. Now that I think about it. I will say, I've been, I've been having really bad... Um, where it all... Is that... Did it say where it all began? The waste where life began. Now we're going back to the origin story of this world, I guess. Ooh, it's dark. I don't like that. Oh yeah, I have I have the speed on. Oh, you know what I just realized? I don't even have a power up. I think I'm mad at that Or mad. Why is there a snake? Uh, excuse me. Yeah, we just shoot around here. Or are we here to get rid of all of the wildlife? Can I, I can. You know, learn new things about this game all the time. Okay. What the heck is that? Dude, a, a little bit of overkill. Two, three flying times. Not bad. So it just looks like this level is just where I shoot things. I'm an expert gunsmith. So don't worry. Don't 
No more. So, uh, do I just... Excuse me? I'm an expert. I promise. been very bad for me uh, recently. Especially today. Today was bad because like I woke up and then all of a sudden I was like there is no in between. So I don't, nothing comes out of it. That's crazy. Uh, I guess I'll just Yeah. I can't get over that hat. It's such a good hat. All the hats are good really. Ooh, we got new, another gacha palm. Oh, what the heck? Can I give me an extra chest? I wonder whether this is all gonna be useful. Can I dig up those fossils? I feel like I should be able to, considering the fact that. Who's the sniper yet? Right next to an octopus. Nice! Oh, the lost. Oh my goodness, that's so sad. The feet, the lost squishy? I just murdered a lost, you know, squid. It did not deserve to die, but I just did it anyways, you know? Alright, that one is done. I feel like I'm gonna whiff this jump. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I'm an expert platformer. I know what I'm doing. Ah. I got you. Come on. You don't scare me. I am I am used to things falling on top of me. I guess this is where my journey ends. I guess that rain cloud. Uh maybe I should uh yeah, do that. Hey, that's not a lot of damage. As much as I just pulled me with the other one. Oh, nice! You know, it's a good thing this is not a wildlife preservation. The Kirby just doesn't care. Ah, oh, crap. That's a little unfair. Like, I thought I was gonna stop it. But, you know, I didn't. Kirby would be in trouble if this was a wildlife preservation. Oh, that's what that did. That's gonna be a shoot. Ooh! You know, I wonder if the, the gotchas are all random. Or if they're all just set, you know, to be a certain thing. Because they have to hit them all of these. At least that's the first one. Wait. We're this far into the level and that's only the first one. Ooh, blueprint! The crystal! Noise. Hey, we got a warp star. Really are long levels. I guess we're getting towards the end. Does that flower not do anything? Well, not to me, does it? Oh, okay. Uh, I don't think it's possible to blow that away. Blow me away! My favorite, uh, Breaking Benjamin thing. That I only know because of Halo 2. I feel like that's, that, that's what happens with a lot of songs, you know? It's like, you don't, you, you hear it, and then it's just like, nope. Uh, I'll never remember it again until it shows up, you know, as a meme, 15 years later. It's like, oh. Oh, I see. Like, I can't, um... There's one that was like that. I can't remember which one it was. Okay, so I have to... Wait, wow. Wow, it? Wait, what? Oh, do I have to blow it over? Man. Let's 
go. Bottle D number two. Hopefully, hopefully, you know, in the future, these bottle Ds will, will bring something good to this world, except for, you know, just bringing me more facilities. Anything Kirby does in this game is just automatically just like, it's like, oh my goodness, leave me that guy. Anything can be said for the Waddle Dee. Like, just look at them. I think we're just saying that Kirby games are just filled with joy. If you don't enjoy Kirby, you're a soulless monster. And I don't know if I can, uh, I don't know if I can stand for it. Where's the last floating toy? Oh, I don't send me out to Like, I know my, my title says, um, you can enjoy Kirby and not bore. Uh, I feel like it's pretty normal. At least to me. Like, if you... Okay. If, if you, if you, if you enjoy bore, I'm not gonna say I'm gonna stop you from enjoying it. Just, are you kidding me? The fleet Florina using ring math? I didn't know you could use ring math. Cappy. <laughs> if you enjoy horror, I'm not gonna stop. I'm just gonna judge you heavily. What the heck? One dog and one beat. When Daria's founder based the part's most popular characters on their own two dogs. One dog and one beat. These two friends travel through the cosmos together in their story, working as a team and having all kinds of wild adventures. Yeah, you enjoy, you know, more. Not my thing. This big old sword is definitely gigantic. It's a bit hard to swing around. That will keep you well guarded. Use it to shield yourself from attack, then go on the offensive. Oh my goodness, it's Waddle D. Look at our boy. It took it took like four worlds to be able to see him, but here he is, from volume one. These delightful residents of the planet's pop star landed in the new world before Kirby arrived. Things looked grim when wild beasts began to capture them and steal their precious food, but with Kirby's help, they're rebuilding their town and starting over. So we're creating a new civilization, is what's happening. Well, you do you, I guess. Ooh. Are they gonna be locked? A lot of detail. I mean, who? I think at this point, like the residents, they're they're just a bunch of like un uncivilized. That, I think that's what. Oh my goodness, this, that makes me sound bad. Um, it's a it's a it's a ah dang. No matter what I say, I feel like I'm I'm, I'm saying it the wrong way. You know. Using land that was, uh, you know, that they found. Yeah, no, there's no good way of saying it. They're just a US. What? Oh, it's this guy. Oh, it's another one. This is how I, this is how I do it, huh? Thanks. Ooh. 
My boy Kirby got the skills. You know, I actually thought about it. Now, now I'm thinking about this. And it's kind of relevant because you're, you're doing swords. Like, I want to play a, a game that's like. That's not exactly Dark Souls. But you know, it's 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 got that, you know, that feel of a soul side. I don't know. Will it be fun? I don't know. I don't typically enjoy Dark Souls games. I've played one, three, and Bloodborne. I feel like that's a pretty like wide scope. Of, of Souls games to play. So, I don't know. It, just, it feels... Like, it's not my jam. But I'm always down to... Wait, is this... Oh, yeah. Easy. I feel like I should have to... Oh, crap. Oh, my goodness. You know what this reminds me of? What the hell, man? It reminds me of... Uh, Nickelodeon Guts. You know the... What? I hit that from underneath. Kirby's hammer is just that good. Alright, so if I swing too early, I fall. Okay, this reminds me of the Agri Friends. Which really is the only thing that you need to... to... to, to know about... Nickelodeon Guts, it's the, just the aggro crag. Somehow, despite that, that fall, I still did pretty well. Kill me. Alright, on to the next one. Actually, I do have that blueprint. So let's go to Waddle Detail. Oh yeah, that's still Kirby. What the heck? Oh, what the heck? I got a pond? I can go fishing! The 155 Waddle Dees you saved work together to make the town even bigger. Now you can play Flash Fishing and try to land some big catches. Alright, we're gonna have to... Look, if there's one thing I've learned to enjoy as I've played more and more games is the needability can be lost. Not that. But just enjoying the fishing minigames. They have, oh my goodness, I've enjoyed s the fishing minigames so much now. Now that I'm older and more wise. Like, holy crap. I love fishing minigames. Oh, I can get the homing club? I don't even remember. Wait, there's a missing power up? Huh. Alright, how much does this cost? Well, I'm gonna take the needle. All of that money that I had saved up, gone. Maybe I should start getting the target times. Ooh. So is this better or worse than? It's better. Holy crap! Oh my goodness, that's so fast! Oh my goodness! I want to waddle or uh, never mind. I'm already fast, so I don't need to worry. Alright. Yeah, fishing time. Oh my goodness, he's got a hat. When a fish bites, the button icons will appear. Press the correct button as fast as you can. Don't let them get away. Keep on catching. If you get several fish in a row, you'll eventually snag a big one. Press the buttons quickly and try for a high score. Alright. I'm... I'm... I wouldn't say I'm very good at quick time events. But I try. Okay. 175 grams. That's pretty big. Ooh. Ooh. Alright, yeah. This is gonna be like... This is gonna be big. 500? Holy crap. That's... That's so big. Come on. Okay. So it always ends with X. That's what I'm learning. There we go. Holy crap. 
Well, I could fish for days. Come on. I told you, it ends for next. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, that's a big boy. I'm gonna get all of my credits by just fishing. Okay, not as not as big. So I wonder if going fast is what allows me to uh, be better. Oh my goodness! They almost got me. Oh, oh my goodness! That was that was too fast. Dang! They really got me. <laughs> I love that. Yeah. That wasn't my that wasn't my greatest mark. I'm a little upset. Oh, am I only gonna get fours now? Ooh, look at that. You know, I've only gotten fishing. Um, IRL. Only a few times. And it's... Like, I don't know, I've, I'm too impatient. To, to, to really, like, enjoy fishing. And also, I'm very sun averse. Which, now that I say that out loud, I feel like that's not a good thing. Like, if it was a cloudy day, I would absolutely be fine with fishing. Oh, you almost got me. Oh, you almost got me. Oh, there we go. Oh, we got the golden fish. All right, we got to keep on fishing. Oh, and we got a gotcha pond. What is it? Ah, fishing pond Kirby. <laughs> Trita, Ira. See, here's the thing. At least with gotcha games, at least with gotcha games, you get you know something out of it. You don't always get that when it comes to um, when it comes to, to IRL fishing. Sometimes you won't even come home with a fish. At least, at least in this and, and gotcha games, you get something. It might not be good, but at least you get something. Ah, Kirby's doing a bit of fishing at the old fishing pond. He looks super relaxed. Or sorry, super, super relaxed. Maybe too relaxed. Hey, pay attention, Kirby. There is exciting stuff swimming in the pond, including the legendary Bling Blipper. Of Waddle D Town. How do you always have already have rare fish? The pond just got built. Oh yeah, that's a big one. I wonder if there's gonna be a platinum one. Oh, we got a golden one. We got the bling blipper. His, his, his poses are so good, I love them. Like, if it's just like quick time events, then I can I can do this. I can do this for a while. I want to get another blink blipper. 500 points. That's a lot. Oh my gosh, I'm four away. I'm four star coins away. They're not giving me the bling blipper anymore. I ran out of I ran out of them. Also, when they turn into star coins, do they die or do they go back into the pond? Because if we learn anything, this game is very much unrelenting, and the and the amount of killing that Kirby does.
I hope you understand. I'm just gonna I'm gonna be fishing all day. It's like I can do a fishing mini game. All you gotta do is just zone out. That's all. You just just keep on bringing on topics, and then you just you just you just maybe eventually I'll just zone out and you won't even hear me anymore. Like, it's always the X. I, I I had my hand, I had my finger over it too. That's the worst part. Maybe I was too relaxed. Maybe I'm like Kirby. Do you ever just think about fishermen caps? They, they, they look like they're a, um, they're, um, like they're, like they're stylish. I feel like anything can be stylish. Like, I'm not a fashion, like, expert or anything, but I do like, um, certain items, you know? Like, I'm not a hat person, like, I don't wear hats and all that. But they look so good on, on, on certain people, you know? It's always X. You got another boom flipper, guys. Like, when you think of fishermen wearing the fisherman caps, you think of them like in their overalls. You know, they got their, their, uh, they got their rubber boots on. They're like, that's a good fisherman right there. And like, um, uh, even just like some bucket hats. Bucket hats can look good on the right person. Always X. You know, I guess I could also talk about my hat. Like, I mean, this hat, you know, my, my little jester hat. You definitely have to have the right attire. Oh my goodness, look at him, he was just bobbing. I'll do it for you, Kirby, I know you're, you're fishing right now. a new record. Look at me. Okay, you have to have the right outfit to wear my kind of hat. You know, whether it be the very fashionable, you know, jester look that I'm pulling off right now, or uh, even the onesie. But with that, you have to downgrade it too. You have to go with like uh, the little floppy devil horns. That's, that's what you have to wear. Should I play Sega uh, Pro, Pro Bass Fishing? But instead of doing like the tournament mode, I'm just playing just the fishing mode. I just sit there and wait. I could even do the Yakuza fishing. That's a good one. Because it's also just quick on the box. Uh, Fire Emblem Three Houses has a good one because it's not, it's not just a, um, a like quick time event. You have to like be on a rhythm essentially in order to catch the the right fish you want. Uh, there's a ah, there's another one that I'm not I can't think of right now. Um, what is it? Um, it's 
why do you have to pull on the pull on the record? Nice. So why do you have to pull on the control stick? Uh, oh, I think I, I, I saw a vision of it. Um, you pull on control stick opposite of where the fish is at, so you drag it in. And then, oh wait, it's it's Legend of Zelda, Ocarina of Time, and Majora's Mask. But I don't remember doing the Majora's Mask, but I remember the, the Ocarina of Time version of it. <laughs> Come back to, to Monster Hunter Rise for Sunbreak just to fish. If there's if I can fish in Sunbreak, I will buy the DLC. And that's that's what I'll be doing for the stream. It's like I already have Rise. Once the Sunbreak DLC comes out, if I can fish, I'll fish. I'll get I'll play with you, Fox, until I get adequate materials to make fishing gear. Or not fishing gear, but fishing armor. It has to look right, you know? You can't just fish, just to fish. You have to... Fishing is a mindset. Ah, crap. I got a spring. <laughs> oh my goodness. I messed up my streak. They still let me have the big one. Oh. They're really nice. Always ends in X. Yeah, fishing minigames are fun. I think it's because it's something I can do. That's an outdoor activity that I don't have to go outside for. Like another one is um is bowling. I love bowling minigames. Am I very good at a lot of them? No. But like my favorite kind is the Yakuza bowling. Really Sega bowling. Like any Sega game, because they all use the same like type of um style or engine. And it's so good. Wii Sports is a is a solid one. It's not it's not the greatest one. It has its flaws, that's for sure. But it's a very solid, you know, one. What else? What else has bowling minigames? I feel like I don't play enough of those, but I, I play enough of fishing to know all the games. I couldn't get into though is, is the farming simulator games not the, the farming simulator franchise but games that, that do farming like stardew valley um not really animal crossing but pretty close i would say like stardew valley um What's that? What's that other one? Um, Harvest Moon. That one. Animal Crossing to an extent. Like, there's other things to, to enjoy about Animal Crossing. The whole maintenance of a area is not my, my not my thing. I think that's a bad thing now that I think about it. But I'm learning. I'm learning to get better at, at you know, the simple stuff of life. Oh. Oh yeah, are we going back down in time and and fishing. Yeah, maybe you have to be fast in order to get the stuff. Okay, yeah, so we're back up there. This music's really good too. It's very relaxing and it's like softly muted. Like, it's just perfect. It's perfect. 
Some of my favorite sounds involve water, now that I think about it. I don't know, water just has, like... It's so good for many things, like... The sound of rain, that's water, you know, hitting the surface and creating that splat sound. Um, you have, you know, ice, you know, skidding a across the ground or dropping and breaking. Such a, like, crisp, solid sound. Um, snow. The crunching of snow, that's a good one. Like, even the ocean. That's a good sound. And all of those things that, that you know, they have in common, that they're all based off of water. Who would have thought? But I would say fire also has a good sound. Because of the crackling. The only bad part about it is that it's hot. Maybe it's just the ambient sounds uh, I'm enjoying. But on the other side of that... The other side of ambience noises is that sometimes it's creepy when there's the lack of. Because, like, um, I don't know if anyone else has problems, like, sleeping and all that. But, you know, when you, when you sleep, like, what I do is I put on, like, YouTube to just, just relax. You know, I'll have some white noise because I've... Because my, my, my house or family um, home was full of, of, oh my, are you kidding me? How? It was full of noise, especially even at night. Because, you know, if it wasn't the people, it was the animals. If it wasn't the animals, it was the appliances. So, like, I, I would, I pretty much always had all that noise in my life so when I moved out it was less um, like there was no noise like you get some noise outside um, but it's not a lot and it's just it's it's eerie especially after I watched so when I go to sleep I've, I've for some reason oh my goodness not again When I go to sleep, I put on like horror videos. Not not really horror, but like um um like creepy videos. Like um there's a good channel called Next Book that does um like internet mysteries. Not not it mysteries, but creepy internet happenings and phenomena. And I don't know why. I just, I'll watch, I'll, I'll put it on at night. And I'll just listen. And, like, while I'm going to sleep, it's fine. I can handle it. But, um, uh, when, uh, when it's, like, 2 a.m. And I'm still on my computer trying to, um, uh, trying to take care of some things. I say take care of some things. I'm literally just... I'm on, I'm on, like, YouTube, or I'm, um, making some more, like, stuff, uh, for, for the streams, which I actually have, I've, I've been doing some work, so I'm pretty happy about that. Ah, crap. Is that a crab? That's a crab. <laughs> oh, no, the crab died. Yeah, it's just it gets to you. Have you have you ever been to SCP store? Not okay. I haven't really like been into it in the sense that I actively like look out for them. So my main exposure to SCP is from Nightmind. Um, 
who, who did a um, SCP vault kind of thing where he basically um, goes through a bunch of different SCPs ranging and then um, threat levels and you know he just he goes and you know talks about it and it's all like in character too like in universe so it's like I, I don't go seeking out SCP stories that's just me but yeah, if, if they were presented in a way that, you know, makes it engaging to, to listen to, then heck yeah, I'm all about that. I feel like that's with any, like, form of, of you know, um, entertainment or information. You have to make it engaging. I will say, though, there was, there was one video that was recommended to me on YouTube. Um, it was like how like how to basically it, it was it was using like math and geometry to unbend something without like uh, breaking the the shape essentially and it was like a 10 no longer than 10 it was like 12 years ago and it was from a video from the 80s or 90s i don't remember one of the two it was so like like it was very much a boring video in terms of the, the topic but it was so good and like execution because it was you it, it was two characters you have like the narrator one and she's basically explaining how the process goes for like unbent oh crap i messed up i thought i got it i looked away it was basically just um Narrator one, she's explaining how to unbend in. Number two is like, he's basically the us. Like, he's the the, the audience with terms of questions, uh, interactions, like with how you would do something. She's just, she explains it in a way it's like, oh, this is how it would go. And then narrator two, he would come up and just say, oh. So if we did it like X, Y, Z, then we'll be able to get the thing no problem. And she's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that kind of that kind of engagement where like you have someone who's asking the question that we would ask. I like that because it makes me you know understand it in a way that you know it lets me understand what she's saying and like normal layman's terms i wish i could remember what it was called but i'm sure if you could like look up how to unbend us actually i think it has something to do with like circles yeah let me let me go look it up real quick Dang, I really wish I remember what it was. Cause it was it was good. And it was 15 minutes or it was it was it was almost an hour long. Um uh, How to Ben without No, that's not it. Breaking, is it breaking the shape? The line? This sucks. I really wish I remembered what it was. Because it was good. Maybe if I, if I find it. 
if I find it, I'll, I'll, I'll try to see if I can uh, look it up. Or I, I can show it. Not show it, but tell you about it. Because, dang. Stuff like that is what gets me. Like, interesting science. Like, I don't care about science normally, because, honestly, it's... I don't... I could if I wanted to. I just don't have any intrigue in it. I think that's what it comes with a lot of things about me. Like, I I do stuff that I that I want to do. Which is not always a good thing. I wonder if you can guess it this way. I should try that. Like, um, what, the YouTube algorithm? It's actually been, like, really good in recommending good videos recently. I don't know if you guys have also been getting that. But it will, um, it will recommend... Well, first, they'll recommend, like, obviously some, some good crap posts. Those are my favorite ones, personally, because my sense of humor is broken. And, um, you know, I got that zoomer humor. So I'll laugh at pretty much anything. I think that's what it is. And, um, just, like, interesting videos that you wouldn't see otherwise. That's what I like. And it's like, it's, okay, so it's videos that you wouldn't normally see. Oh, hello, what's going on? Thank you for the raid. Uh, Gato Bonita. We're just doing some fishing. It's like it. I was, I was saying before that, that Kirby, oh my goodness. It's, they gave me a fishing mini game and that's what happens. Yeah, I've been at this for about uh, 20 minutes now. And I'm almost... I think maybe maybe once I get to max coins, if they're in the max. I'll go ahead and uh, actually continue on with the rest of the game. But this is just... it's so peaceful, it's so calm. Almost got me. There it is. Easy peasy. Dang. Like, this is really the easiest way to get money, huh? It's just farming. Or not farming, fishing. Yeah, I can get upgrades. I can get, you know, more gotcha. My addiction is fueled. Maybe this is hitting the dopamine. I think that's what it is. It's like, you get to do fishing. You get to, you know, catch fish every single time. Unless you're bad at it like I am. Or you'll get crabs. The actual animal. I think it's weird that we call, like, we we know what animals are, but, like, we don't, we don't really, like, think about animals themselves. Like, we, when it comes to animals, it's mostly just the normal, uh, like, you know, cats, dogs, the, the furry ones. But you don't think about, like, arachnids, anthropods, are those the same thing? I feel like those are the same thing. I think arachnids are in anthropods. You know, insects. Like, you think of them as those sub, like, sections. You don't really think that they're all a bunch of, you know, animals. 
Or at least that's what I that's what I think. Like what fish? Like fish is an animal. But a fish is a fish. I don't know. Maybe I'm just not, you know. Maybe maybe I'm just ignorant of it. My boy, my boy just wallowing. I'm starting to learn that fishing. Fishing is the method. I should I should get one of those hats, you know, um, women want me, fish fear me. That's, that's what I should get. That's all I'm about in life. Just fishing now. Forget, forget actually playing the game. We're professional fishermen. Ooh, buddy. Easy. I really wish there was a platinum fish. I'm just like I know I said this before, but it feels like if you get a high enough streak, you should just be able to get you know better than gold. I want a thousand star coins. I think that's what it is. to hold this many fish. Does that not seem weird? That I'm, gonna, I'm pulling out so many fish? At this point, I don't think there should be any fish in the pond left. I feel like I should have fished out all of it. Maybe they just reproduce that fast. I'm not gonna get into the, um, the whole uh, area of that when it comes to fish. Cause that's, I'm not, I'm a, I'm a pink ball that loves to absorb things. You think I have any idea how any of this works? I just realized, I, I, I just remembered that Elphalin is still missing, and I'm just fishing. Kirby doesn't have a care in the world. Found his calling. Also, why did they wear goggles? They're fish, they should be able to see without goggles, right? I'm pretty sure there are other fish in this game that don't- they have like actual fish in this game that don't work out. So why are these, um, I think they're called blippers? I don't remember the tutorial. Yeah, we can just look at it. Okay, never mind. I'm wrong. Yeah, maybe this is my calling. I should just be a fish streamer. But instead of IRL, I'm just fishing and fishing games. That doesn't sound like a bad idea. After coming home from a nice long day of work, is hop on, uh, hop onto your boat, just go fishing, virtually. That way, there's always catch or fish to catch. Also, I really hope chat isn't broken. If anyone's saying anything right now, like my chat's not bringing anything up. Okay, okay. Thank you, sir. Look at those waddle geese in the back. They're just enjoying themselves, blissfully unaware of the tragedies that's happening outside of the town. Oh, look at those birds on the stump. I'm starting to learn the location of Waddle Dee Town. 
as I'm just sitting here fishing. I wonder what's the highest I can go in terms of weight. Because I feel like I haven't reached it yet. They all look exactly the same, but somehow they're just slightly, slightly, you know, bigger or smaller. So I wonder what a 12,000 gram fish looks like. Oh, oh, we got another big one. Ooh, you almost got me. That's good to know. If you, if you if you don't if you do it too fast, then you break it. Just like in real life. Do you know how much strength it it has? Like it takes to, to be able to um, fish in real life. Like I have noodle lungs. So when I was um, Oh, almost got me. I have to focus on that just to make sure that, that I don't mess it up. Because you're at the last part. Like, if you want to get that fish. Dang, we're almost there. We're almost at 9,000. I thought it was going to take longer. But it's only been like 30 minutes. And I've been enjoying every single minute of it. I think this is what I want. I want a relaxing game where I don't have to like think about doing something. I can just talk. Oh my goodness, am I just am I just talking about a podcast? Instead of a podcast, it's a fish cast? Oh my goodness. This is the greatest decision I've ever made. It's a fish cast. Alright, hello everyone, welcome to the first episode of Devlin Fishing. Uh, today's game is Kirby's and Kirby and the Forgotten Land. And we're just gonna be fishing. Oh, this is an ASMR now. <laughs> so I hope you guys do enjoy um, all of the fishing that I am providing today. It's not it's not too um, too you know complex. All you have to do is just hit a few buttons and we can just talk about anything we want. I'm sorry to anyone who has to has to endure that. But that is a good idea though, I will say. I, I very much am interested in just fishing. Yeah, now this makes me wonder. How strong is Kirby? Because he has the he can pull in these gigantic fish. Now I'm an American. I'm an ignorant American to the you know, greatest extent. So I don't know the metric system. Like I don't know um I don't know metric to imperial. So I don't know I don't know how much these guys weigh, but I know that when you go into the thousands, it's a little heavy. Cause like that's when you start messing with kilos, right? There's kilos a hundred thousand. Really? Yeah, maybe I'm just overreacting when it comes to these fish. Cause how big is Kirby? Kirby's not that big, because we've seen Waddle Dee, and Waddle Dee's towering over Kirby. Is Kirby the size of us? Is he just that pink ball that you're afraid to go see? Because he's just so massive? Death Battle determined that Kirby is stronger than Majin Buu. Huh. So that just... So how strong is Majin Buu? I need these answers. 
I need, I need relative, you know, comparisons. We can't just compare a fictional character to a fictional character. I need real world. Oh my goodness, we're past a thousand or oh, nine thousand. Yeah, you know those comparisons where you have, um, where you have someone saying Kirby is only eight inches tall. Oh. Oh. What is, what is this? So, are we just saying that Kirby is an ant? He's taller than an ant, for sure. But the fact that he's able to lift more than probably a hundred thousand or a hundred times his body weight. Now we need to figure out what Kirby's weight is. Well, we know he's, he has to be light enough to where he can float in the air, but also dense enough to where he can also fall on the ground. So we need to find that in between. Because all he has to do is just um, hold his breath gesture a little bit and becomes extra buoyant. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, because Kirby, he can float. But he doesn't drown or anything. He can barely go underwater unless, unless he like actively swims downwards. He doesn't go underwater. Hey, there's your little Kirby tidbit. He's he's buoyant. Why am I getting so deep into this Kirby lore? Holy crap! This is not what I expected it to do when my night. But then again, I didn't expect to be fishing this entire time. Is this... You know, I learned that Kirby is right-handed. You don't notice these things until, like, it's, it's in your face and you have too much time on your hands. Like, did you guys know that Link was predominantly left-handed? It was only in recent versions where he became right handed. It started with, I believe it was Twilight Princess. Uh, the Wii version is when they made Link right handed. Because most people are right handed. And so, when you, um, when you swing the Wii remote, you're holding it in your right hand. And so, they wanted, you know, Link to be able to slash right handed so that people can actually do the movements. And so that's why in um, Twilight Princess, the Wii version, um, Skyward Sword, both the Wii and um, Switch version, and I think Breath of the Wild is right-handed. But yeah, that's... Oh my goodness, not again. That is what caused me to, like, just, like, I'm left-handed, so the amount of left-handed people is very slim. And I noticed the left-handers just, it, it's like whenever you see someone in the world, it's just like, you, you see them, it's just like, oh, oh, you're left-handed? Oh, crap. Get the wrong one. I'm like, oh yeah, me too, I'm left-handed too. And that's the end of the interaction. You don't say anything else. You just have that collective knowledge that the person you just met is left-handed. Especially even at where I work, I have a bunch of uh, left-handed uh, co-workers. And you don't notice it until either they point it out to you, or you notice something that they're wearing in the case that they're left-handed. Because they have um, special safety covers that are for left-handed people. And it's a different color, so when you see someone hold it, 
This is or uh, crap. How did I hit Y first? You know that's fair. When you run in, in games, you press Y and then press B to jump. Yeah, when you like when you see that color, it's just like oh, they're, they're... oh yeah. That is your binary code for today, guys. Uh, one one zero one one. I don't know what it translates to. If you do, let me know. But yeah, this this was a tangent based off of just Kirby. Kirby didn't even do anything. He just was holding a pole. Where is he getting the string from? Well, I guess it's it's a part of the fishing rod. But the fact that the rod never breaks, that's uh, some of the best fishing string ever. And pole, because the pole hasn't broken yet, despite these gigantic fish. Am I overthinking things? I feel like I am. Should I be overthinking things? No. But I am. I can't stop, guys. But I should probably continue on with the game, but I can't. It's just fishing is so good. I've spent, um, what are we at? 40 minutes now? Almost? On just fishing? Like, here I was going to play a. A, a different kind of game tomorrow, but I'm honestly considering just doing fishing because I haven't I haven't decided what game I want want to play because I could finish Inscription. Inscription was a really fun game in case uh, no one saw it. And if you never played it before, oh my goodness, it's so good. I'm so glad I decided that I wanted to play it. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna stop. Where? <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, let's see the leaderboard. There he is. The biggest one was 10,645 grams. Oh, so it's all based off of time. 25 seconds, really? I feel like that's, that's, that's not real. I feel fake. Oh, that was Kirby with his hat. No littering. Alright, we'll, we'll continue on. Let me go upgrade my stuff real quick. Oh, I can go buy stuff too. Oh my goodness, I have too much power on my hands. Alright. Home and Bob. So what is Home and Bob? I, I, okay, I'm not gonna ask what it is, but how strong is it? What the heck? It gets wheels. Oh my goodness, this is kind of power. Like, how is how is this fair? If they ever make a smash game, and this is in here, it's over. Make another smash game, I should say. He really didn't deserve that. My man got trashed on. Alright, we're gonna go to the store. Because I have money. If I ever get bored while, like, just sitting at home, I'm just gonna do fishing. And there's no one, nothing anyone can do to stop me. I think it's good for 500 seconds. Oh no. No, don't, don't drop it. Kirby, why, why are you like this? I wish I could buy five at a time. This would be very useful. Oh yeah, just hold down eggs. We're doing that. Okay, you guys have to wait for the prompt to show up. Alright. 
Yeah, this was just. <laughs> oh my god. This was. It was. There was too much fun. I very much enjoyed fishing. I can't stop talking about it. I'm sorry. Oh, for 200 seconds. So I'll wait to use it until I'm at 700. Because it only goes up to 999. So can you only have food or a boost? What's this? Oh, a stone. Nice. Gotcha, we'll have to wait, I promise. I will get to it eventually. Oh yeah, that's the professor. Professor? I have a paper. Searching for the o oh sorry, searching the oasis. That's that oasis has nothing in it. I feel like I'm lied to. Alright. So I imagine the cutter is going to be Oh, there's a salamander. Is that a lizard? Oh, there he goes. Oh, am I gonna use water? Maybe I'm using water. Because there's a bunch of poison. And what we did last time was use a bunch of water. Give me that, give me that sun. Ring. How's that now? Okay. So he has some water. And here's your buoyancy. I mean, he has a. Okay. Kirby, you're not helping my point. This man's wearing a floaty, so he doesn't drown. In older Kirby games, he was not. Like, he was not this weak. So, does that not do anything? Come on. Come on. So, what's this provide? Oh, we're just long way. Look at that Gordo. Alright, here's an idea for another, another stream I can do. What if... I did lawn mowing similar. Where'd that where'd the nut go? That nut did not provide me anything. Yeah, what if I do lawn mowing similar? How would everyone feel? I would be down for it. What are you? What are you doing? So how do I Get this guy out of here. I don't think I can. Yeah, let's try. Nope. Ow. Why oh, I lost my oh! He still keeps the thing. Oh my gosh, that's so powerful. I know in other games that if you got hurt, you're uh dunzo. You lost your beam. Stop that. No, is that the... Uh, are these the... Um, I forgot their name. They're not spines. They're uh, the cactus enemies from Mario. Oh, that didn't really stop me from getting it, huh? Oh yeah, let me get some boost. Honestly, playing this without using the speed boost, I don't know how I would go about that. What are the secrets? The buzz soft cutter. I feel like that could do some serious environmental damage, Kirby. <laughs> Kirby don't care. Bam. Like that's me something I can do to get these like get this guy out of here, right? Oh yeah, there we go. That's something. Ah, you kidding me. And I got it. Right. Oh my goodness. And there's water. Oh, uh, here we go. No, that doesn't do anything. What is that thing up here? Yeah, what's this? Oh. 
That's not good. That's a sewer level. It's a pink ball. Oh, what the heck? Is this the next part of the stage? Did I accidentally go to the next part? Well, I mean, I don't know why they're so worried about Spicy corn. Damn it. I don't know. Maybe I should call it spicy. Spicy corn. <laughs> if, if you're an American, you'll call it spiky corn instead of spicy. Yeah, so this was the next part. See, there's the water hydrant. Oh, I needed the mold ability. Oh, well. I really wish there was a bone throw ability. Like, wouldn't that be cool? Like, sure, it's just like all the other ones that allows you to throw things. But think about it. Bones. Wait, what'd that do? I didn't do anything. Except waste my ability. <laughs> you can't even go underground! I bet you I can't unearth it. Is that, the, is that the saying I'm gonna say now? I'm going to unearth it. Hey. Hey, you're not so tough now, are you? Defeat two poison crocodiles. Okay, sure. Oh, that's... Wait, what is that even for? Oh, just let me get out, I guess? No, excuse me. There's one. Okay. Two. Dang, and he just eviscerates him. Well, I guess he pierces him. He didn't do a good job piercing either. Well, I guess I'll do it the normal way, I guess. Oh, you can just hold it. Oh, no, never mind. Yeah, I think you know how to play the game, and then they do something different. We don't need it. Intelligent digging in the secret room. Oh, is that what that did? Nope, that was a hidden bottle D. Huh, so if you got all the, the things, you, you got an actual bottle D safe. Imagine being the bottle D that's basically not uh, saved because Kirby didn't feel like digging. How tragic must that be? Oh crap, I need Or can I? Nope. Kirby only goes so far. Alright, we're diggers. <laughs> the dig no dinky hole. I still don't know why that's a thing. Like, I get it was a it was from a fan. But diggy diggy hole became a Ooh! Oh, well, that's how you do it. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about when it comes to the memes. They make a song relevant. There we go, another gotcha. We all know this is what I desire. I desire the game. So this guy dies because he did not... Jiggle. This guy cannot be poisonous. Oh look, I saved all the hidden model Ds. Did I save all of them? Nope, I missed one. Hey, that felt like... That level felt weird. Because I wasn't doing anything until the very end of it. So what's the last one? Take a nap. I... I... <laughs> I knew. Cash of all these. One of the Waddle Dees is being held captive by the fearsome beast pack. There's so many out there waiting to be saved. You can almost hear them calling out. 
for help. Let me out! Let me out. Wait, do you hear that too? One of them must be nearby. Ah. Wild Proxy, the mysterious vortex from Mr. Proxy. To New World 2, he arrived shortly before Kirby and the immediately joined the Beast Pack. Form change must have been made. But the change in wardrobe must have made it an easy choice. Yeah, once you get a new outfit, everything changes. That's when you get to be new. It's tough to be the new guy, but his fellow beasts love working with him. Oh my goodness. Wild Frosty is just a good he's a good guy. Oh Starfield. So canonically, Wild Frosty is the best co-worker to have out of the Beast Pack. Staff side? The heck? What does that mean? Alright, alright, I have a blueprint, so let's go back to town. I'm not going to be fishing again. Even though I very much want to. Oh yeah, I know, I know, I can upgrade the, uh, cutters. The cutters. I'm very interested. Uh, do I wanna... Nah, cause it feels like I'm just doing the same thing over and over again, you know? Oh wait, I don't have any, I don't have any stones, do I? Cause I need a third one. I can't do it. But I'll go for, uh... I haven't used this one. And this one's not still fast. That's really the only reason to do it. Is because that thing's moving! I just hope I don't lose it. Alright. So what's this one? Trail treasure? Oh, you just use the regular deal? Weak! Weak, Kirby. Oh, yeah, I have the speed boost, too. Oh my goodness, is the speed boost a necessity? Because it feels like it is. Yeah, yeah. This time. If we're doing, you know, um, ILs, doing, doing speed boost is the way to go. We're changing the meta. Or maybe they already do it. Yeah, maybe I'm just slow and never go. Wait, what? Oh, I have to go this way. Holy crap. I really don't want Kirby to live. You know, now that I think about it, why the heck are these forces up there? Because it's not doing anything for Kirby. He's getting fast time. Okay, he, never mind. He's getting these stones. But why is he? But how we make it? To a treasure row. Let's see what's inside. Scissor lift mouth. Sorry, scissor lift blade. Ha! Uh, we got no time to waste. Oi, look at that. We're, we're, we're professionals. Come on. I 
think I have to wait. You can't like immediately press. It. You know. Hey, you have to wait for Kirby to be fully up and fully down. Can't speed run this. I said I'm trying to speed run. Here I am taking all the damage. Go, no, go Kirby, go. Go Kirby. I gotta wait. Or do I? Oh, I could definitely make it. Nope. Go, Kirby, go! You know, it's worth a shot. You learn something new. Dang! Are you kidding me? 229.99. Holy crap. Exactly. You know, we gotta save that. Hmm. Picture taken. Sorry, capture taken. Why do they call it captures, not pictures? Still pictures. What was this? Dragon fire. Kirby's so, like, he was so nice. So happy. You know about that whole the, the, the thing where Kirby looks meaner? And the... Oh, that makes it go faster. Can I just... Oh, I have to melt the ice? Gotcha. I feel like fire should be able to, to melt it. Okay, what am I doing? I need to go... No, don't go the other way. I feel like this fire should be able to melt it, right? Come on! Oh my goodness! Crap! This is not going away. Alright. We're good. Alright, so, um... Maybe using dash attacks are not my thing. Yeah, that, that speeds it up. Okay. Maybe what I should do is, instead of lighting it like that, I should just, like, melt all the ice, and then hop in the cannon after lighting the flame, and then just speed run. Yeah. Alright, that's one pretty Nice. No, get out of here! Yo, yeah, is the fire coming? Okay. Uh... I was not expecting that. Oh my goodness. No, no, it's perfect. Yeah, yeah, I hear you. Alright. I, I feel like I could have done it a lot faster. Maybe? Oh, time stops. Nice. Alright, that took 0 0.01 seconds to get over there. I don't know how I could have done that. Uh, yeah, I know how I could have done it faster. Don't listen to me. to the other side. Oh my goodness, it's such, such cheerful music. What a helpful mall. Oh, uh, there's the sleep. I'm not gonna... Ghosts! Who is afraid of ghosts? Who is fighting? I ain't afraid of no ghosts. Oh my goodness. I'm an ice cream cone. They were not happy. Ooh. Ah. What? How does that work? Oh, 
I'm a ghost exterminator. I must get rid of all of the ghosties. How can I? I was. Okay. Wait. Is there something down here? How am I supposed to be a ball? This makes no sense. Yeah, how am I supposed to do this? Unless... I have to go this way first. Uh, the answer is yes. Wait, what? No. Right. Oh, there we go. I have to be a ring. Alright, we're on the move. Jeez. Hello, Rude. And then we go. How does that work? How do I destroy walls? By just sheer force of will. Kirby is a force to be reckoned with. Okay, so I take damage. Is that where I'm supposed to go? Wait, how does that not work? Ah, oh, I got rid of Mr. Cutter. Does he respawn? Alright, there's Circle. Or that's, uh, um, I don't right. But it's re irrelevant. Alright, where are my goals? Only goals. Oh, okay. oh, what's in here? oh, what the heck? How does that hurt me? You know, I love how I'm still collecting star coins as if at this point it matters. I kind of miss my cards. Or oh, my needles. Is, um, now that I think about it, is the Kirby 64 game on the Wii U eShop? Because if it is, I kind of want to get it. That'd be a good, that'd be a fun game to play, because I never beat it. Ow. Ah, what the heck. Did I ever get that? Oh yeah, I got the Wild Frosty. <laughs> I can't get over the snowman. I thought it was a drink. What, I have to be bonkers? Do it. Do it. Ow. Bonkers. I'm telling you, it's not safe. You just broke my snowman. Ah, oh, now he's just stuck. Sparks yet. I don't know if it's a one that we can get in this game. Cause there's still one ability we're missing. I don't know which one it is. I wonder if we get the DD head. DD hammer. Oh uh, no, you get the wild hammer. You get to be bonkers. Alright. Kirby 64. Oh yeah, that's right. It's the expansion. See, I don't have the expansion. Wait, is it already out for the, um... The... Switch? Where is that child? Like, I hear it. Well, where is it? How am I supposed to hit it? There's a lot of rings. Alright. Well, let's figure 
miss that, I guess. Oh. No! Uh. Uh. You know what? And that sounds good to me. Alright, mouth for that. Come on. You know, I watched I watched that video, and like the moment I saw the beans, I was just like, beans. And then I learned. You know, it became a meme. Oh, yeah, was that where the waddle dee was? I honestly was not even paying attention. Get something bigger. Oh. And we go. That's probably what it is. Holy crap, did you see his mouth? Yeah, not too bad. You can't stop me. By sheer force of will. coming in here and just wrecking everyone's stuff. Because I can. Kirby is a sociopath. That's what we're learning. I feel like we already knew that. But this just adds to it, you know? Awesome, we're almost done with it. It's kind of sad because I I, I, I I want the speed on it. That would be real sad if I just decide to just eat it. Not the ice cream, but just eat the ground. Fit through all the holes. Nice. Pachi pachi. There was the one I was missing. The fate wild bunkers using the cutter ability. That's why Sir Cut Kibble. My name is Sir Kibble. One in posters. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, those 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 Kirby faces. I was a boy. Elfland. A mystical new friend you met in a mysterious new world. You found Elfland as he was trying to save a lot of these from the beast pack. He seems happy to be Kirby's guide and sharing the helpful advice to save the Waddle Dees and rebuild their town. Thanks, Elfella. Windmill switch. A uh hive. -huh. Moonlight Canyon. Oh my goodness, another flying section. I don't know if I can handle this, guys. Alright, where's my, uh portals. The portal. The portal. Oh no. I only get one gun. Not two. I'm half of this fishing. That's the way I was going for. Wait, can I just... Yes. I can't. I think that was faster, honestly, with how far I was. Mm 
one 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 five four. Hmm. Oh, we got six now. Uh, what was the one? What was the other one? Crystal Needle Treasure. Alright, easy. Yeah, might be that might be my new favorite uh, movement option. Oh, that was good. All right, let's return to Waddle D Town, and we'll go and upgrade. That's what we need to do. Because I've heard that this is maybe this is. One of the hammer abilities is the best one. I don't remember which one it was. But I'm willing to give it a shot. Oh crap, I ran out of speed. Oh no, it sounded like an addict. The wild hammer bro. Goodness, what the heck is that? That has so much power. Oh my goodness, look at our, look at our little Kirby. Holy crap, you're not fast. Oh my. Yeah, you're not fast at all, but I'm willing to give it a shot. What is this? Kirby? Does that mean I maxed it out? Oh, what? Hold on. Excuse me? Holy crap. Also, it looks like, um... It looks like, uh, Josuke's stand from JoJo Part 4. I forgot what the name is called. Like, really, the, the things I know most about JoJo's parts, uh... One, two, three. I don't know if that's a good or a bad sign. Yeah, I don't think this is gonna help. Dang. He just, he just died. Why is everything so slippery? Oh, a blueprint. Twin drill. Ooh, baby. I'm never gonna like it, but look at that Kirby poster. Three wanted posters. Uh oh. Oh my goodness, he's got hair. I guess it doesn't matter. With that at least. I feel like there's something I was talking about. I don't remember what it was. Yeah, we don't need light. <laughs> we need light. 
Like, I knew it had something to do with, um, you know, the pink floor. Can we just die? Alright, what's over here? A platform? A platform. Oh, with a... I feel like that really wasn't a hidden waddle D. It was just like, oh, did you, you know, do the thing? Good job. Oh. Holy crap, this, this music. to say about the music is I like it. Oh yeah, well, oh, there's the hidden poster. Oh, okay. the music is so good. You can't stop me. I'll take the damage. See that? Do you see that? It really gives me a lot of time to do stuff, which I appreciate. It makes not having to think very nice. Sleepy cat. Do I get anything for a voice? How did I miss a third one? Crap. It was probably in that area that I didn't touch. Yep. I'll be clear without falling. Huh. So let me see if I can backtrack. You know how Kirby games love their backtracking? Oh, there he is. They're right next to each other. Up we go. Oh, my goodness, that guitar. <laughs> Was that our thing I go up there for? Was I imagining it? Yes. Because that was the only thing. Maybe it was something else. I feel like I should be able to break it with my hammer. Oh no! He was just living his best life. What if they hit a Waddle Dee on there? You need to see it if you fail. He just dies. So can't do anything for this pipe. Who's wrestling? Oh. 
on me. Kirby takes to the sky. That's a Mario reference. The question is, where's the Waddle D hit? You know he's hit it somewhere. They're always hit. Okay, never mind. That is not it. I thought you could go down. Oh no. Wrong exit. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Now go, go, go right. Nice. So I wonder if you could grab that without having to take the right path. Dang, it was really at the very end. The hair fits him so well. <laughs> nope, I don't need to retry. I am perfect. And we got a gotcha. Oh, what is this game? Oh, it was dark. Yet. I promise. Is this, or, no, this is a hedgehog. This is a hedgehog hide. I got two out of three. Find the treasure hiding by cactus triplets. What? Crash up Simon. This logo belongs to an auto shop named Holline? Holline? Custom auto. Part of the Holline port. Holline is also sold industrial parts. Spanish construction made all kinds of stuff. From buildings to streets to music part rides. Remember, it's quality, it's Holline. Or perhaps it was. Would be more accurate. Knock knock. Mantle lockers. Oh, there's the triplets. Never was not. You know, this was um. Maybe I should get a tack up, so I can one shot the boss. Twenty five. Let's go, boys. You know, it reminds me of those mobile app um, ads where it's just like you have a starting point with one person and you walk through areas to get more, um, you know, people by doing ads of addition, subtraction, multiplication, division. And you would have to use the, like, the people to open these doors. Frosty Ice Treasure, oh my goodness, this is gonna be bad. That's what it reminds me of. You're just adding more Waddle Dees. Well, Gotcha isn't set up. Set but made up as you played along. What? Hold on, maybe I have to read that. What if the Gotcha isn't set but as you. but made up as you play along? I think that's the case where, like, oh jeez. Where, um, oh my goodness, they just, they just fall into it. Oh wait, dude, do I have to, um, use the snowman? Yes. Gordo's got me? Are you kidding me? How? Oh. Alright, there's that one. Wow, well, Frosty, what you doing? That didn't work. This works. He doesn't know what he's doing.
What? He just ate me. Oh no, I lost my extra body. That's fine. I didn't need it. What? Hey. Alright, so let me make sure I read that right. What if the gacha isn't set but made up as you played along? I th I think that's how it works, where it's not set and the, the, the terms of, you know, each gacha ball, you know, is one where you... Oh yeah, I'm going back. I, I, now I remember what I'm doing. That's why you basically just, you know, you get random chance. Wondering at what 80 Waddleby's you saved together, work together to rebuild the games booth. Now you can play Tilt and World Kirby. The lore is all over the place. Everything is made up. That's what we agree upon. So, oh, there's the stall. Can't believe. We'll do life up. We'll do that one first, then we'll get the other ones. Holy crap, I'm at 9,000 now. This doesn't feel good. To have only 9,000 coins. Alright. Yeah, we're speeding up. I feel bad for. <laughs> you know, didn't um. I think I think I remember Sakurai saying something in an interview about how there is no continuity between all the Kirby games. If I remember correctly. And this was shortly after the this Kirby game came out. So, you know, nothing, nothing makes sense. It's all made up. Do I really need all this attack up? No, but I want it. Oh wait, is that how this works? No. No, that is not how it works. Alright, now we learn. I right, only use tilt to uh, tilt and roll Kirby. Step right up, get your hands on the latest, greatest game in town, tilt and roll, roll Kirby. Come and try it out sometime, Kirby. Oh no. Just stay in front of the game booth and press A to play. Yep, I knew it. Tilt the controller to guide the balls in the mar rewards marker. If you exceed, if you successfully reach the goal, you win a reward, the harder difficulties win, the greater rewards. I, I, this isn't that hard, right? Um, the sensitivity. Um, so that's it, something. No! <laughs> Look at the little curvy ball, I love it. See, this is how you play. You just... You're not here to actually, like, strategize. You just brute force everything. Oh my goodness, how? Come on. Whoop, come on. I... That, that was... That was a bad one. That was a bad one. We see Kirby rolling down the, the board. He's making good pace right now. He's on par for, for actually completing this course on time. Oh, and he makes it! 15 seconds! Yeah. I'm pretty good. Wait, that's how you get? You only get one? You clear the touch and roll Kirby star. 
Well, there's another one. Pretty good at this game, Kirby. I've decided to add a new difficulty for you. Give it a try. Sure. Oh, there's two of them. Okay, you have to get both of them. I give up. I could do it, but I'm not. What am I? What are the ones I have out? Okay, I have Bandana D. Who's the other one? Oh, Curl Mouth. <laughs> right, let's put you away. Oh no, I want the um. Where's the wanted posters? That's the one I want. Oh, uh, there they are. Just look at this. Look at that Kirby face up top. <laughs> He's so good. I never go into Kirby's house, so why should it matter? Alright. To the world map. Here we go at the end. Collector in the Sleepless Valley. Alright, so I think this is what I will do last. Um, because we're coming up at two hours, which is kind of crazy. Let me slide. Why does Kirby have insane grip? I'll use that. Oh yeah, of course I'm going to use the hammer. I feel like I don't ever use the hammer. Look at this. <laughs> I'm telling you, look at this. Look at these guys. How can you not? Okay, I forgot. It doesn't it doesn't let you take zoomed in pictures. I realized I've completely wasted some time. That's a fake elf one. Kirby, I know you're supposed to make it. I know you're stupid, but come on, you should have seen it. Oh my god, he's dead. This is a TV. This is a silly dillo. I'm a play prancer. Oh my goodness. Holy crap, that was that was a lot of damage. It's like, that's a lot of damage. Hey. Ah, that was bad. How? How did I dodge it the first time? I'm coming. I'm coming for you. Holy crap. Come on. What? I'm trying. I'm trying so hard. It should be possible. Hey, Timmy. Oh, what is that? His dancer. Oh. No, give me the hammer. Oh my goodness. And we got him on the dance. Kirby's too good. Easy. Defeat Silly Dilla with a hammer blade. Easy. Blizzard eyes. Ooh. So, did I get a thing for defeating them under a certain amount of time? Uh, I feel like I definitely did insert that. What other Waddle Dees are there? Two minutes. Okay. Clear without taking damage. Okay. I had a hammer, okay? I never had tons of damage. Like, once I actually hit him, that's when everything became easy. <laughs> oh, there we just... Oh, where's this? Oh, Waddle D Town. Okay. <laughs> 
Ah, uh, they added volume three. Oh, you got DDD. Gacha machine number three is available. And I can do a new ice ability. How many stones do I only have two? Alright, so this is where I'm going to call it here. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Uh, Mr. Fox, I do appreciate you coming over and staying for a little while. Um, I will see you in the morning, hopefully. I, I, will, I plan on waking up at a normal time. Uh, today was not a normal time. But, oh my goodness. We, we did 14%. Or 12%. Or 14 I don't remember what I started with. Of progress. So that's pretty good in my books. So with that, um, tomorrow, you might see... Yeah, this was really fun. This, I fished for over, an, over 40 minutes. That, to me, was just impressive. Like, the fact that I could keep going for that long. And I could have done for longer. I could have done for longer. So yeah, um, I'll see you in the morning. I'm going to get some sleep. Uh, I say that. I'm gonna be awake, guys. Don't, don't let them know. Yeah, and tomorrow I'm thinking of Vampire Survivors, which is a, a game that everyone's been playing right now. I said, let me try it too. So yeah, with that, I will see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye.